Here we are on part three of case number four in the murder mystery machine, The Sinews of Thy Heart. After the information of the first two parts in this case, we have found a lead that led us to um, a local game studio, Dali Dali Game Development Studio, as you can see. So let's head right in and see what we can learn. See what we can learn in scene 4.3. Dolly Dolly Game Development Studio Midtown 10 a.m. All right. Find potential murder motives. Anyone here? Yes. Let's first talk to this person. Supposedly either the manager or some employee. Kevin Go. Testing. No. Good kid, keen to learn. Didn't last long. Right. Always late. Fell in with the wrong crowd. Right. Rather join a gang. Hmm. His friend turned up at the office. Which friend? Doing it for his mother, you know, Mrs. Kugler. No, he said they're from high school. All right, she wanted work, wasn't even paid. Hmm. The mystery visitor. Hmm. Tattoos. Gone by close of business. What time would you say? 5 p.m. Long gone. All right. The life of a game producer. See what we can find. What we can find around the studio. This computer's clickable. I hear you're the guy to talk to. I'm trying to get my hands on something for the weekend. Look at the top grade, and I've heard yours is best. I ran tonight. I can meet you downtown park. Ah, the drug deal. Potential drug deal. There we go. And there's something on the board here we can click. Office notice. All employees remember to sign out all equipment every time. The sign-out sheet has not been kept up to date. Items have gone missing. All right, everyone has access. Interesting. Interesting. Reminder to sign the equipment out. Anything in here we can click? Doesn't seem so. Yes, something on the little table. What is it? Strange drawings. Hmm, weird. Anything here? No. Right, let's talk to Kevin again. About leaving the computer on, possibly. The email, yes. The office notice, missing equipment. Of course. Right, strange drawings. Talented artist. A tattoo design. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Tattoo designs and a memorable tattoo on the mystery visitor, possibly. What do you know about that? Something similar on his forearm. Hmm. Doesn't really give us something new. 
The mystery visitor was looking to buy something. Potential drug deal. Or he was going to meet him in the park for that. Possession of drugs. Potential drug deal. Goes together? No. No, no, no. Mm, missing equipment. Maybe he was buying equipment, the guy. Instead of drugs. Could be it. Hmm. No stolen equipment in Justin's bag, but more strange drawings. Interesting. Gang involvement. Alright. Gang member. Gang affiliation. No proof Justin stole equipment. I remember going to it. Well, it makes sense. It makes sense. Theft related. Gang related. Because the mystery visitor was a gang member. That doesn't seem to be drug related now, does it? Doesn't seem to be. Wasn't working late. Meeting in the park. Gang affiliation question mark, gang member question mark. Hmm. Could be gang related. But we don't know why. Justin was in the possession of drugs. We know that. Interned after school, but he wasn't working late. Looking to buy missing equipment. But there's no proof. Justin stole the equipment. So where would the equipment go? The stolen equipment. Hmm. Hmm. Potential drug deal. This one's in the possession of drugs. We don't know. Wasn't working late. So why would you? Meeting in the park. We don't know. All right. We have to find potential murder motives. It could be either gang or theft related, but we, do, we don't know if it's theft related because there's no proof just install the equipment. There is no proof. Strange drawings are tattoo designs. We know that. He also found the strange drawings in the bag. Meeting in the park with the drawings? No. 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 Mystery visitor was a gang member. Who was meeting him in the park? Could be. Right. Alright. Murder motives. I think, after all we've heard, the motives could be gang related. And. But the theft. The theft. Maybe the mystery visitor saw, saw the things. Oh, we don't know. We don't know. But it could be. Let's go for it. Gang related. Theft related. Let's put it in, see what happens. 
Incorrect. Well, in that case, it won't be theft with drugs. I think. Does that make sense? There, there it is. Obviously, because there was no proof for um, no proof for the theft, it must be the drugs. Yeah, must be it. Here we go. So we know that Justin was involved uh, or in contact with gang members, and he was carrying drugs. Let's go back to strengthen the case to HQ. See what we found. Just another side, right, obviously. Max must know more, obviously. Logo on the bat, sports bar downtown. All right. So that's the next location, the sports bar. Right, that concludes part three of the investigation into this case, The Sinews of Thy Heart, and that also concludes this video. Um, again, I would like to ask you to like the video if you found it helpful at all, and I will see you in part four in the next video. Enjoy your day.